I'm Rosanna Falconer. I am a fashion consultant. I've worked in fashion for over 10 years. I started out at the British Fashion Council, then I went on to work at Matthew Williamson. I am also co-founder of Fashmash, which is a fashion and tech network. It's got over 500 members globally, and this year it's expanded into a speaker series as well, every month. I have always really been so inspired by um, stylists, designers, particularly stylists. I just watch them at work and I'm like, you're amazing. I would say that my style is feminine, romantic, very colourful. I rarely wear sensible things. My husband often says, you're either in a ball gown or you're in tracky bums. And I don't really have that midway point at all. I just love really impactful looks. You've got to have that kind of why not attitude. Wear things that make your heart leap and make you really feel so joyful. And I just think that that will rub off on other people. This jumper is by Christopher Kane and it was one of the first designer pieces I ever bought. I was working at the British Fashion Council at the time and we were invited to one of his sample sales and I was front of that queue. I mean, eight years of wear and look at it and I wear it, I'd say at least once a week for about four months of the year. The really ingenious thing is there are buttons all the way up the sleeve and all the way down the side. So um, you can wear it a little bit more loosely or more tightly. It brings back a lot of really happy memories of being in my 20s in London and a real fashion lover and just feeling like I'm in the thick of it all um, and, and right in the centre. It was amazing. So I live in a jewellery box of a flat. It is teeny tiny and so I'm going to have to just step out and get some other pieces that I want to show you from my other wardrobe. My wedding party dress! It makes me feel so happy even just looking at it. So the print is actually called the Rosanna Trellis print. My eponymous print, which I never dreamed would happen to me from Matthew Williamson. Um, and it is a mixture of very British sp spring flowers all between a garden trellis. And there are dragonflies, there are butterflies. They're all the motifs that I love that Matthew Williamson has been doing for so many years. It felt amazing because I went to put it on after dinner and suddenly it was like, and now I'm ready to party. So the last one is this skirt by Ronald van der Kemp, who specializes in, as he puts it, sustainable couture. He finds um, offcuts uh, of fabric from his studio that probably wouldn't have otherwise been used and then puts them all together into this incredible, masterful piece. I just love that attitude to sustainability, that idea of finding things that might have been cast aside and then putting them together and fashioning something new and exquisite out of that. I think it's so exciting that there are now designers working in a sustainable fashion that are getting noticed and that also are doing really eye-catching exciting designs. To me, this was just an irresistible piece. Then when I found out it had this sustainability credential, it was all the more reason to invest. It's just this idea of mixing the textures that just make it such an unusual and special piece that I know I'm gonna be wearing for the rest of my life, provided I can still fit into it. Um, if not, I will just hang it and look at it happily in my wardrobe.